just like anything else, I guess, just practice. You do it enough time, you, you do it without thinking. Cobalt blue is a very stiff glass, like I say, it's difficult to um, get it moving. Twist it up like that and condense it down. Just going to cool that bit off so that I could. It just took a while to figure out, I mean there's several different kind of ways of, of making the same thing, but the current way I do it is, um, seems to be working good, so I'll stay with that. Started off, I painted the colour on the clear, then melt it all in, twist it all up so I get like a spiral, and then I'm condensing it all down into a sphere but I have to keep it rotating because if I don't it will just flop down as a result of gravity. So while I'm doing this you might notice that the light energy is coming directly through the end of this clear rod and I can't keep my hand over the end of that rod because the, the amount of light energy is it, just too hot so I just have to keep my hand to the side Alright, so now I'm going to split that into a heart shape. Basically like that. Okay, I'm a little off center. In fact, the bullet's set up completely, so... Okay, I've messed this up completely, but the thing is, I've always found in my lifetime experience that the skill is in the recovery, right? So let's see if I can try and recover this. So. stripey effect from twirling it that seems to how would you say accentuate the shape yeah that's coming into a heart shape That's it. Yeah. 
just a spontaneous event in the universe. Look at that. It's beautiful. Thanks. Well, it's just to put a loop on the top and... Like I say, because of the lines, you could see the, the effect of the heart shape. Okay, it's cooling off a bit now, so you could see. And that, that's why I thin out the blue as well. If I just do it in a blue, it's just too strong. Too strong. Uh, it's not as translucent. Yeah, that's it. Almost looks opaque. Tiny flame down. Just need a tiny, tiny flame. So it's just to get um, some material on there that I could make a loop out of. And um, once I've got that on there, then I could shape, concentrate on shaping the loop. Because I need to get some good welds on here. Like a little radius in the in the corners, um, rather than sharp, sharp. So this is what I'm talking about, just with a a simple setup, just a little torch like this. Somebody could um, feed themselves once they got the basic skills down. It's not hard to do, it's just the time it takes to to learn it and so just by using the flame I could encourage it a nice a nice loop. Okay, then we just about got it. Round out the hole in that loop. Like Sorted. I'll just cut this off the off the make it hotter. Yeah, get some more heat in there and then. I want to try and stretch it off the... Okay. Oh,